Well, also tonight, if you really needed a sign as to how bad the opioid crisis in Western New York has gotten, here is one for you. The state now wants everyone to carry a drug that reverses the effects of an overdose. It's part of a new state campaign, and it left us with a lot of questions. Will it really help? What's the cost? And is there enough to go around? Well, two on your sides, Heather Lee went to get some answers today. Mary Ellis, the message encouraging New Yorkers to carry Narcan to potentially save a life is part of a new public awareness campaign that kicked off this week. Those ads will be on social media, at malls, and in the New York City subway system. It focuses on the potency of fentanyl and the risk of drugs laced with it and how deadly they can be. The educational campaign directs people to the state's combat addiction website. The push for people to carry Narcan is getting mixed reviews, as you might imagine. Some say it's not my problem, not my responsibility, and why in the world should I pay for it? While others argue it is a way to save a life and give someone a second chance. Now, Erie County holds free naloxone training sessions, and upon completion, you can get two free doses. Though county leaders have encouraged people to purchase their own naloxone at the pharmacy so that the county can use its supply for first responders and those who truly cannot afford it. Earlier this afternoon, I talked with Horizon Health Services. They say that they are happy with the state's campaign and recommendation to carry Narcan. Is this a Band-Aid on a bullet wound? I don't think so. I think it's an additional resource and it's an additional avenue. You're talking about something that can actually reverse a heroin overdose. So I think that's an incredible resource. I think that's giving somebody a second chance at their life. Now, I reached out to the state health department and asked if this is a small fix for a growing problem, a deadly problem. So far, I have yet to hear back. I also called a number of pharmacies today, and without insurance, two Narcan nasal sprays on average cost about $140. The state also has a program that covers up to $40 in copays for naloxone. The Narcan is carried over the counter at more than 2,000 pharmacies all across the state. According to the state, overdose deaths from opioids were up 35 percent from 2015 to 2016. Fentanyl related deaths increased by 160 percent statewide during that same exact time. Horizon Health Services says education is more important now than ever before because fentanyl is so potent, it's so deadly, and oftentimes there is no second chance. Reporting live tonight, Heather Lee, Channel 2 News.